Hey guys, it's Toby DeMoss, KDP Publisher, and hopefully I can help you also grow as a publisher. I learned two things this month about publishing and running a YouTube channel that I did not know about myself before and that I think might be very relevant to you as well as a human and as a publisher business person. The first one is that I do not do so well with hate mail. I did not expect this to happen, but what happened was I posted a video a little over a month ago about my first year in Amazon KDP publishing and it did really well. I got a lot of traction on it and at the end of the video, the problem was I promised a part two. Now, there's no problem with that. In fact, it was really exciting to me that I got all this traction I can build off it with a part two. Problem was that I had a pretty bad chronic pain flare up. And so for a month, I didn't post a video and it's even past a month now, that video hasn't been posted yet. And I started to get some comments that were not too thrilled with my delay. And I took it really personal. I remember lying in bed late at night after reading the comment. There was one particular comment that was a little bit, a little bit harsh. And I was literally in bed, just like struggling to breathe and feeling anxious deep in my chest. And I'm like, how does this happen? How in the world does some random stranger on the internet affect me so deeply, affect us so deeply? And that leads to part number two, the second thing I learned, which is that a lot of those pressures, that pressure I was feeling and the anxiety that I was feeling, those deadlines, those are so often self-imposed. Like, it, it's, there, there's no real pressure. It's a facade, it's made up. There's no real timeline for most things in life. And so we get to choose our schedules for the most part. We get to pick our days and if your boss wants you to, to get a report done over the weekend, but you have a family to tend to, tend to your family, you know? If I have a body that needs attention, then I'm not gonna post the YouTube video. And it's a learning curve to get to the point as someone who's a people pleaser by nature. How do I get over that hump, that fear of man of like wanting to please everybody? I don't know yet, I'm figuring it out. But I will tell you part two is being edited right now by our my, my team. And the crazy thing is, this takes that lesson to another level. It's that my editor, he had a serious family emergency halfway through editing the video, which delayed the process by about a week and a half. So I got the opportunity to extend that same kind of grace to him as I had wished that other people had extended to me. And I'm just learning, man, Take care of your family, dude. Like, you got things going on. I got things going on. Timelines, deadlines, they're a lie. <laughs> they're a lie. Let's do the best we can. We're doing great. You're doing fantastic. I'm doing fantastic. And one day at a time, keep learning, keep growing. It's not about a, any particular destination, is it? Like, I think it's really, I'm. I'm coming to know the process is the beautiful part of everything. Like the process, the process, the process. And I want to get more excited about the process. You know what I mean? So have a great day. Keep publishing books. And I'll see you in the next one. I promise no deadline.